Welcome back to the Bruise and Boost channel everybody. Today we're going to be working on a new project car. A Juke Nismo RS. So we're going to be doing some things to her. Soup it up just a little bit. It's mainly a commuter so not going to go too far but it's pretty decent. You get the Recaro seats inside. A little, little bit of carbon fiber additives and stuff. Don't mind the mess because we're about to go on a work trip. But today we're going to be installing the GFB blow off valve. Give her a little bit more noise. Should be fun. All right, here's the blow off valve. Comes with a ring seated in there already. This one also has a little dial here. To, uh, I don't know if I could do this with one hand. To open and close, whether you want to vent to atmosphere or recirculate. You can see it in there as it moves. Should be pretty cool. It'll help with throwing any CEL codes or running rich. Just need to dial it in and We're get it to the this right thing settings. Full open, dude. Yeah, it'll be full open. We just need to get the idle right on it basically we'll just take this off it's just pinned in there i think four pins oh is that cracked oh sad day oh sad day there's a hair that's a crack oh it is a crack i'm gonna get a metal one oh, sad carbon. Day. time for a carbon one right why is there just a chunk of foam weird that's good questions insulators so basically it's right here the recirculating Boop. one that comes for factory so there'll just be a bolt here bolt, bolt on, the, on the other side 10 millimeters take this, off, take this one off which they supply this you kit supplies one. you with a new one and Done. then we'll start testing her out get her dialed in all right got the stock one off this little turd right here that just recirks back into the turbo but here's what we're doing with this new one so what they want us to do is take this up about three millimeters which from the picture looks like it's just a little bit having right the right yeah having the bolt come up a little right about there and then we're going to set the ring to a 50 50 split so that way is if you look into here this opens up and then if i open to the other side that opens up exactly the same. So now that it's 50-50 split and on the softest setting, we will put it on and then start the car. And what you're wanting to see is through the trumpet side, the side that will be venting to atmosphere, you want this to just barely be sitting there. And then when he gives it a rev, it should come up and then come down nice and easy, not too fast, not too slow. It shouldn't open fully while it's uh, under, not under load. Yeah, it, it will never open up all the way unless he's actually on the road and it has load on the turbo. So yeah, if you're here for a juke part installs, then now would be a good time to like and subscribe to our channel because we have more to come for sure. Also, if you uh, go out and on your maiden voyage with this in the softest setting, uh, they say that when you come up to a stop sign and if your idle dips low to come out and give this about uh, two turns and then try it again, repeat the process until you don't have a weird uh, dipping down on your idle when you come up to a stop sign when you let off the throttle. And you want to do it with your AC turned off. Yeah, don't, don't have that on because that creates engine load actually. And also, <laughs> when you're under load and let off when you're up above three. 3500 rpm you don't want to get a flutter sound they say it's usual for the flutter when you're in lower rpm but if it goes up over 35 and you're still getting it you're going to want to adjust your spring so we're going to get that on and start fine tuning her in all right so new one is on hang on the camera's not really focusing right now there we go new one's on just so you know, these are 10 millimeter. 
the hose they provide is a clampless hose for the air hose. Everything goes on pretty easy, only really takes a few minutes. So now we're going to start her up. We're going to watch the inside of here, make sure everything goes good. Ready? Yep. Give her a little rev. Okay. Running really. Is it open? No. Closed. Closed. Close. Okay, good. Alright. Oh. Alright. Give her a little tightening. Again. Go a little bit more. It might have came the way it was supposed to be on flat. Right. A lot of things I've seen on these ones, it needs to be pretty close to all, all the way, way. tight. That's how it is on the Maxima, too. I got that thing all the way tight. Right. But the maximum is weird. It sits here and idles at like 25 pounds of vacuum instead of 20 like on the other cars. Okay. Hang on. Alright. Give her another little go. No. Needs to go tighter. So we're going to want that inside part that's opening up to be closed before it comes back down to idle. That's why we're getting this stumbling, basically a vacuum leak. Right. It's almost there. It's not quite closing by the time it comes down to idle though, so we go down a little more. Are you flush with the bolt now? Huh? Is the bolt flush? Oh the bolt's pretty in there. Oh. I don't know how far it in there. Yep. to go farther. Should be a bottoming and out point, right? Let's give it one more. Problem is going out too far. Yeah, it says don't go out too far. That was close. Hang on. Yeah, I'm gonna go a little bit more. It's close, but no CV. Okay, give it a try. The 
it's not closing before idle. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Give it another try. How's the idle? Idle staying nice? Alright. Alright. Turn it full atmosphere. Wrong way. Hey, okay. give her a try. It closed like right before idle, huh? Right. Give it a little more. It's not stumbling. It's coming down. It comes down really, really slow. You need to get a lightweight flywheel. Yeah. She's ready for the drive test. Yeah. All right. Time for the test drive. Put it in sport mode. atmospheric blow off so none is recirculating back into the turbo and there hasn't been any codes or nothing yet Ooh, no a little, little burnout right there it's a little bit of something huh? let's hear it oh, fuck yeah. they love it give it <laughs> Woo! Woo! that's cool I like that That'll be fun. Uh -huh. All right, well, everything seems to be good, so we're gonna end the video with that. No issues so far <laughs> besides that. Uh, yeah, basically it's a straightforward thing. Pretty so easy to do. Make sure to like, subscribe, and follow the journey for the juke. <laughs>